What's good, everybody? We are having a cornucopia, a plethora of wax pack, uh, <laughs> wax pack, uh, junk wax, if you will, uh, cards from the late 80s and early 90s. It's a wax pack of palooza, if you will. So, a lot of, you know, I came across these in, uh, on eBay. Somebody was selling this entire gamut of uh, different uh, series uh, over the years. Uh, and one thing, it was like 15 bucks. So, I figured, hey, you know, might as well give it a shot. A lot of these I've never opened before. So, I, I figured you guys would like to watch this. We'll probably can do this in probably less than 30 minutes. And uh, we'll go over uh, what we're going to open up here. We have some Donruss. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what year these two are. We have Donruss Baseball. I'm presuming 8990 or, or maybe even 91. We have uh, 88 uh, Tops Baseball. I used to open those in middle school. Uh, we have an 89 as well. We have a Fleer 1990, 91, and 92. We have Upper Deck Baseball 1990 edition. Uh, we have some Score 1998 uh, Baseball. We have three packs of those. We have one pack of, looks like, 1990 AAA baseball cards, and we have a series, uh, the first of the tops, big baseball cards. So, like I said, a lot of these are pretty much new to me. In fact, just about all of these are new to me, except for the 1990 Upper Deck and the 1988 tops and 1989. Everything else uh, I have never opened up before uh, in my lifetime. So, this is going to be a brand new experience for me. Hopefully, we can come across... Uh, something worthwhile, maybe some rookie cards, uh, you know, maybe Ken Griffey, Bo Jackson, uh, uh, what was that, <laughs> I wanted to say Randy Jackson, uh, but uh, that's all good, let's uh, take a look, uh, Randy Johnson, that's the person I was thinking of, well, we'll take a look, uh, let's see, we have Deion Sanders as well, now that I remember, we'll take a look, but first, uh, if you like these videos, you can always like, share, and subscribe, Help us grow, uh, trying to get to 100 subscribers, hopefully uh, by, you know, summertime, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and start off with the AAA uh, Line Drive Pre-Rookie 1991 cards. See if there's anybody here we recognize. We have... Uh, Tony Chance, D.L. Smith, Phil Clark, Louis Mercedes, Keith Hughes, and we have Steve Howe. Oh, I'm going to keep flipping these around. Alan Cockrell, Carlos Rodriguez, Greg Legg. Wow. Ah, uh, Sal Agostinelli. Ray Searage and Derek Bell. So I think a few of those uh, made it into uh, the big leagues. Uh, we're going to go to what I already know, what I've already dealt with many times. We're going to do the 1990 upper deck here. Knock this out quickly. Let's see what we have. We have our ever friendly checklist. Then we have Tino Martinez, Jose Cano, Dwight Smith. We have Jamie Moyer. And then we have Dave Parker. We have the Chicago Cubs team sticker. Junior Felix. Kevin McReynolds. Matt Noakes. We have Jeff Musselman, Randy Bush. Brett Saberhagen, Jody Reed, and then the final two in this pack, Mookie Wilson and Scott Geraltz. We'll go ahead and open up the other 1990 upper deck. We have Bob, Rob Ducey. And then we have the Mark McGuire checklist for the A's. We have Scott Kulbaugh, Joe Carter, 
Then we have Steve Bedrosian, who uh, looks incredibly unhappy. Uh, Don Mattingly. So that's probably the best card so far. Bo Jackson. All right. So we got a, a decent card here. With, uh, we have a Phillies team sticker. Ah, cards are jumping out of my hands. Kurt Gibson. Ozzy Smith. Then we have Rob Dibble. Uh, Tim Tufel. Lou Whitaker, Wayne Tolleson, Gus Polidor, and lastly, Dan Plezik. So not a bad stack of cards right there. So what would we like to do next? Uh, let's go ahead and do the Donruss Series 1 Wax Pack. Maybe I'll figure out uh, what year this is well cool first thing we start off we start off with the diamond kings we start off with the diamond kings ramon martinez then we have brick jacoby matt noakes Valido perez <clears throat> and this is a 91 mike gallego hansley mullins kelly gruber brett butler gino petrali greg harris another diamond kings craig biggio dave stewart Harold Reynolds and Lee Smith. So we have two Diamond Kings in one pack. That is uh, quite awesome. Let's go on to uh, the next one. I'm guessing this is a little bit older. Maybe, uh, maybe late 80s, 87 maybe. Oh, 1990. <laughs> uh, Mark Portugal. Jose De Leon. Uh, Carlos Martinez. Tony Armas, Manny Lee, Jerry Reed, Kurt Wilkerson, Terry Kennedy, Gary Reedus, Tony Castillo, Kevin Hickey, Chris Carpenter, uh, Todd Froweth, Fernando Venezuela, and Sean Heligas. Not as cool as the 91 pack. All right, we have a jo uh, Jack Armstrong, and we have another Diamond Kings with Willie Randolph. Then we have Danny Jackson, Cal Ripken Jr. All right, Dave Parker, John Morris. Then we have, uh, looks like a poorly cut Greg Briley. Wow, that just <laughs> took off the top right there. Uh, Rick Russo. And Kevin Bass or Bass. All right, on to the next Donruss. As we do the odd Donruss, we'll move to the 90, I mean, 1988 score. All right, so this is a uh, 19, was it 88? My old eyes are telling me. We have. Mike Lloyden, Gary Thurman, Dennis Martinez, Jose Rijo, Jerry Don Gleaton, Mike Devereaux, Jay Buner, Spike Owen, J Jim Morrison, Pete Stanishek, Steve Kiefer, and then we have another Diamond Kings with Devon White. We have a lot of Diamond Kings today. Jim Lindemann and Greg Maddox. I'm pretty sure a lot of, at this time a lot of these cards were like 40 or 50 cents at the time. We have another Diamond Kings with Ivan Calderon, Vince Coleman with the Cardinals, Lee Smith, and events like Albert Hall, Cal Daniels, Juan Samuel, Carlo Carmelo Martinez, Kevin Bass, Jerry Hairston. Sean Hillegas, Pete O'Brien, Devon White, and Andres Galarraga. All right, on to the 1988 score baseball. Wow, this is probably, uh, goodness gracious, the toughest pack. All 
All right, we have Dave Schmidt, Jesse Barfield, Ozzy Smith. All right, get that in focus. Tim Burke, Joaquin Andujar, Craig Reynolds, Dave Henderson, Mark Salas, Jose Okendo, Rick Horton, Mike Gallego, Rick Mick, Mike. Oh, I want to say Rick. Mike Dunn, Kevin Mitchell, Luis Agavo, Agayo, Reggie Jackson. Looks like 1976 Orioles. And now we have Dennis Rasmussen and Gene Garber. I guess that was a throwback card. Apparently, I'm <laughs> really going out of focus here. All right. Jose Cruz, Juan Samuel, Tony Pena, Mickey Brantley, Matt Williams, Brett Butler, Al Newman, Don Slott, Jim Morrison, Bob Sebra, Jerry Don Gleaton, Matt Young, Rick Ruschel, Rick Aguilera, Jeffrey Leonard, Bill Gullickson, Gullickson, and Fernando Venezuela. I like his upper deck card where they show it in like a triple action shot. Alright. Dave Schmidt, Jesse Barfield, Ozzy Smith again, Bob Brenly, Robbie Thompson, Greg Swindell, Willie Upshaw, Terry McGriff, Andres Thomas, Bob Nepper, Brent Smith, Jose Gonzalez, Gerald Young, Dave Stewart, Jim Wynn, Mike Devereaux, and Vincent Palacios. Alright, so we're going to move on to... Uh, What's near and dear to my heart, the 1988 Tops Wax Pack with the stick of gum. And I promise you, I am not eating this, what, 35-year piece of sugary mess. That was something I used to partake many years ago, and I hated it then. <laughs> I chipped a tooth on it back then. All right, we have Tom Bolton. Donnie Moore, Dave Magadan, Mike Jackson, Bob Welch, Joe Carter. Then we have Wallace Johnson. Then we have an all-star card with Don Mattingly, Jay Howell, Hubie Brooks, a Cal Ripken Jr. card. That is freaking awesome. Robin Yount, Jim Dwyer, and Spike Owen. I can't even throw this on the floor. My One of my dogs might try. Alright, 1989. Oh, man. We have we have uh, the gum stain. The ever-present gum stain on uh, Chili Davis. Alright. We have Steve Ontiveros. We have Andres Galarraga All-Star card, a record breaker, 1988 record breaker with uh, Kevin somebody. <laughs> then we have a checklist, Terry Poole, Scott Lucader, Chili Davis with the gum stain. That just sounds wrong. Tom Prince, Brian Harper, Ellis Burks, Mike Maddox, Dennis Lamp, Bill Wilkinson, and Jody Davis. I think I had a friend a long time ago that really neat wanted that Jody Davis card well, when I was in high school. Whew, man, that just felt crummy. All right, we're gonna save the tops, the big baseball cards uh, for last. We're gonna go ahead and go into the 1990 Fleer. No gum, thank goodness. We have a baseball quiz, which I will not answer. All right. Steve Bedrosian, Kevin Romine, 
Shawan Dunstan, Rob Deere, Lee Stevens, Dave West, Scott Sanderson, Matt Noakes, Bip Roberts. Then we have a pairing up card with Chuck McElroy and Moises Alou. Then we have Jose Vizcaino, Mike Jeffcoat, Dennis Martinez, George Bretz, and then Calvin Chiraldi. Chiraldi. Not familiar with that name. Another quiz I refuse to answer. Kevin Ritz, Alfredo Griffin, Ben McDonald, Dave Smith, Mike Moore, Ken Patterson, Roberto Kelly, Dwayne Murphy, Kevin Brown, John Smoltz with the Braves. Then we have the Boston Igniters. Ah, uh, John Costello, Brad Kaminsk, Dwight Gooden, and Phil Bradley. All right, on to the 91 Fleer. Looks like we have a team logo sticker with the Atlanta Braves. Well, I'll just hold on to it. <laughs> Oh man, bright and yellow. Tom Candiotti, Jeff Schultz, Frank Thomas. I think that's the best card we've gotten all night. Mike Greenwell, Rick Sutcliffe, John Tudor, Jeff King, Terry Pendleton, Tony Fernandez, Tim Cruz, Mike Pagliarulo, Bob Ojeda, Mike Jackson, and Bill Long. So we got Frank Thomas in one pack, and we got uh, Don Mattingly in another. So we have another team logo sticker. Couldn't be just one team. We got four. We got the Pirates. We got the Texas Rangers, the Toronto Blue Jays, and my ever-favorite St. Louis Cardinals. All right, Dwight Evans, Jeff Ballard. We got the team checklist. Mike Harkey, Darnell Coles, Jim Acker, Pete Harnish, Chris James, Kenny Rogers, Adam Peterson, Juan Gonzalez, and Chuck McElroy, Gino Petrelli, and Lonnie Smith. Now we're coming to the last of our run with FLIR packs. We have FLIR 92. Looks like they try to pack their cards a little bit like uh, the Top Stadium Club. Alright, we have Chuck Finley, Rick Gossage, Kirby Puckett's. Jose Okendo, and then we have our record setters with Ricky Henderson, Juan Guzman, Harold Baines, Rob Ojeda, Bob Ojeda, and then Mo Vaughn, is that Mo Vaughn? No, Greg Vaughn, I'm sorry, John Smiley, Daryl Boston, Bob Malaki, what was that? Charles Nagy, John Burkett, Danny Tartable, what was that? Darren Dalton, and we have another league leaders with Scott Erickson. Put that here at the bottom as that stack has gotten quite, quite tall. All right, so we have, we're almost at the end of here at this video. We are just about at the 20 minute mark. Thank goodness we're getting close to the, to what I thought was going to be between 20 and 30 minutes. We're going to open these last two packs and then uh, we'll be done with this video. Looks like we have a little bit of a cartoon here. Uh, <laughs> Alright, we have Ryan Sandberg. Keith Hernandez. Charlie Howe. Steve Sachs. Oh, we have some upside down cards here. We have Larry Sheets. Lance McCullers. Ton, I mean Ron Gidry. 
So I think the best card out of there is uh, Brian Tenberg. And then our last pack of the night. Or of this video. Should I decide to look at something else? <laughs> we have Brian Downing. Stan Jefferson. Willie Randolph. Ozzie Gian. We have Bo Jackson. Bo knows. This is with he, he was with Kansas City, so we have a little little cartoon in the back. That's pretty cool. I think this was more geared towards kids back in the day. I don't remember seeing these uh, when I was younger. Bo Jackson. Mike Levayers. It looks like he's very confused. Jeff Reardon. Mean mugging the camera. So these are not bad. We got uh, we got a Bo Jackson out of that, and that is it. We have come to the end of the opening of the myriad of packs of Tops, Donruss, Fleer, and uh, Score, and a multitude of others. Not a bad set of openings. We uh, got some decent cards, like we got some uh, Frank Thomases. We got some. Uh, <laughs> Don Mattingly's. Uh, we got some Diamond Kings here. So nothing, uh, nothing absolutely special. Nothing that's going to uh, pay off my mortgage. But at the same time, I opened quite a few packs that I've never opened before. Got to see what these cards look like up close, and uh, it was quite the, uh, quite the unique experience. It was something I would definitely do again. Maybe if I'm perusing the the site of eBay and come across something like this for a reasonable price between ten and twenty dollars, I will definitely do this again. But what did you guys think of this wax pack of palooza? This wax wax pack <laughs> pack extravaganza? Uh, I know I'm screwing up the words uh, in a multitude of ways. Let me know. Post in the comments below what cards did you think was awesome? Did I miss anything? Was there anything in here that just screamed out uh, something to you that I just happened to uh, not see? Let me know. Post in the comments below, and I'll talk to you guys next time.